In this video, we will be modifying the patient receipt using Customizer. You can access Customizer by going to File, Setup, Customizer. Here you can select the area that you wish to customize. The patient receipt is broken down into four sections that are then applied to a master customization. The four sections are known as child customizations. They are the company name, also known as the top, patient information, the order details, and the bottom. In this example, we will customize the order details portion of the receipt. We can do so by clicking on it, clicking New Customization, and giving it a name. Once we hit OK, the customization will load in a separate tab. For this example, we will move this information that shows the patient's savings over to the left side of the receipt. And we can save these changes. Next, we will need to go back to the Manager tab and we will need to create a customized master patient receipt so we can apply that child customization to it. Here we can again click New Customization and give it a name. Next we would want to click on the area in which we've customized the receipt. In our example we customized the order details section so that would be the third section shown in this master customization. We can click on that section and on the right side or control area you'll see the option to choose a customization for this report. If we click on that and click on the drop down we'll see any customizations that are available for this child customization area which we've clicked on. So we see the one that we just created and we'll select that one and hit OK. We want to save these changes by clicking on the Save button and then we will need to go back to our Manager tab and click on Affect Customizations. Here we can specify which security groups this customization will be available to and we can also default it to certain security groups. We can also make it the default for every security group by clicking on Default All and then hitting OK. With Receipt Customizations, it's advisable to sync the customizations. To do so, click on Tools and then click on Customizer Maintenance. Click Yes on the prompt and this will process the customizations and synchronize them. Once that's done, you can hit OK and close the Customizer Maintenance window. And now we can take a look at our patient receipt. And as you can see, our changes have taken effect, and the savings field is now moved over to the left. And that is the way that you can customize a patient receipt 